Hey guys, how are we doing? Back on another video from Seth the Programmer, and I don't understand how I missed this one. <laughs> this is such an interesting um, idea for a matchup. I even mentioned it to my girlfriend before when we walked into the shop, and she was like, "Yeah, who would actually, who would actually win that?" Because <laughs> I'm like, Itachi's really good at Genjutsu and all that stuff, right? But then Jiraiya is really good at like negating Genjutsu and stuff because he obviously trained Naruto to be able to get out of it and stuff because Itachi was going to be hunting him down. That was the whole concept. So, surely Jiraiya's got stuff he can do to go against Itachi, but then Itachi's a badass, and I don't know how to call this one. So, let's get into this. And apparently this is with Seth as well, so, um, with swag even. Obviously, it's Seth. Seth programs video. Amazing intro. Let's get into this. Itachi versus Jiraiya. Shidori. Yeah, sweet. Seth Brogan for Goggies. So before we start, I thought it would just be very uh, important to establish where I stand as a Uchiha Tard. Okay, right, yeah. I know that's a <laughs> big retort for yeah. Itachi versus Jiraiya. Yeah, um, your whole argument immediately falls apart because you are an Uchiha Tard. Just All right. Yep. Nothing you, you say you can be taken. That. For one, I defended Jiraiya on Sasuke versus For Jiraiya. an hour. Yeah, that was a long For an hour. The debate. And two, I said Naruto beat Sasuke, adult, whether you agree with me or not. You see, how have I done relevant. these and then not stating, done this one? <laughs> I said that Naruto beat Sasuke, and I think that Sage Naruto is stronger than MS Sasuke, whereas, you know, Swag thinks otherwise. So it's kind of <laughs> like, if anything, I'm on the Senjutsu side of things, right? Yeah. <laughs> So I'm I'm the Uchiha tard here. That's, that's a much more applicable argument. The thing about this though is like anybody who's watched my videos for a while, you know, like like I've been called an Uchiha tard for saying yeah. Itachi stomps Jiraiya. It's like when do I ever rep Itachi in versus battles? Like ever, every yeah. single time he's in a versus battle with me, like I always say, oh yeah, he loses because the people he beats, it's like obvious. But everybody wants to throw him up against people like fucking Minato and. Yeah. Like Madara and yeah. shit, and it's like, yeah, like people called me an Uchiha tard for saying Itachi loses to Madara, and I'm like, it's an Uchiha battle. What? Yeah. <laughs> what the How fuck can I be? Talking? Yeah, someone has to lose. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, like, it, it's a really silly criticism, and That's I guess funny. it's just a way to be like, oh, I was about to have to face the fact that my argument is very flawed, but then I noticed that you have sided with Uchiha on many other occasions, therefore. <laughs> Don't even I debate him, just label him. Yeah. <laughs> yep, just exactly. label uh, But yeah, I mean, Itachi versus Jiraiya, it's just, Itachi is not Sonin level. Like, mm. stop. He's not. He's not anywhere. Yeah, he's way below. <laughs> he's, way, <laughs> he's way below. All right, so why don't we start off with mm. the main misconception, mm. which is the biggest misconception <laughs> in the whole fucking Naruto <laughs> fandom. Right. Yeah. Face Jiraiya. Solos, Kisame. Yeah. No, 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 don't even don't even say it yet because they'll realize how ridiculous it is no. if you say that. It's that everybody brings up the quote where Jiraiya is like like he's about to fight Itachi and Kisame, and not Itachi. Kisame says, "Yo, I don't know if we can fuck with this guy. He's yeah. one of the legendary three, and I'm just one of the seven ninja swordsmen. For, and so like we we need to we need to get out of here." And then Itachi's no, I mean. just like, "Okay." Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> sure, I, whatever. Yeah, and he like goes along with it, and then they book it, and then like people use this as an example. Like, as, right? Okay. Yeah. So that means Itachi was scared of Jiraiya, and I'm like, so both I think it's Itachi situational. and Kisame situational. Ran, right? And you really think that this is accurate? You think base Jiraiya solos Itachi and, and Kisame? Kisame. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? They, well, they, they were probably afraid of his sage mode that like he never used. No, he didn't have it on, did he? Didn't that know he had it. His teacher didn't even right. know. Like, <laughs> right, Payne didn't even know he had it. And on top of that, it would take five minutes to set up inside of that fucking hotel building. Yeah, there was like, a very small, what was he gonna, like confined space. And, and like, <laughs> I, if you really think base Jiraiya is taking out Kisame and, and Itachi. Itachi. I don't know what to there's say. There's no way. You gotta... <laughs> it's over for you, man. <laughs> like, there's... Uh, here's... You're not... Versus battles aren't your forte. Like, that's... <laughs> here's, oh, damn. Here's something about it as well. Kisame says, oh, one of the legendary three. One of the legendary three would imply Jiraiya, 
Orochimaru and Tsunade. Tsunade. Yeah. That means exactly. would have ran away from any three of them. Okay? Mm-hmm. Now, we've seen Itachi deal with the legendary three before. Yeah. Orochimaru. Yeah. When the he strongest. Was like, what, <laughs> at least in base. Whatever, yeah. though. We're not debating. It's like... And he fucking destroyed him. Like, yeah, he did. He wrecked like, him. 14 with, like, just by looking at him. Right, and yeah, it's... <laughs> He, he literally dicked down Orochimaru so hard, Orochimaru's like, I can't even take his body. No, like, he actually dicked him down. Like, all of those fucking phallic objects were penetrating Orochimaru's body. Yeah, they did. Body <laughs> <in the Kenjutsu. laughs> and, like, if you, if you think either Itachi or Kisame is beneath Tsunade, bro, you need to, like, fucking find a therapist, dude. You got really deep-seated issues. Not only that, but this statement implies Kisame is seven swordsman level, like on the same level as like fucking Jinpachi and all of those other people, which no, Zabuza is Zabuza. much stronger. No, I mean, Zabuza and Kisame are definitely much stronger than the rest of the swordsmen, but Kisame is way stronger than Zabuza. It's like, yeah, he uh, is. I mean, seventh gate guy level with no Samehada. Like, that's how <laughs> one of the seven swords, right? Like, those yeah. legendary-ass swords that make people so feared. And, and he's still fucking with 7th Gate Guy. But yeah, base Jiraiya, I guess, is stronger than 7th Gate Guy. <laughs> the same, you know... Uh... <laughs> oh, wait, but but that's that's the thing. That's just Kisame without Samehada, too. So, oh like, God. you think about it. Kisame destroyed version 2 Cloak uh, B, mm. like, with no like, max power. Be? Like, he literally just shat on him. No diff. And it's like, there's no way that this, you know, B, who was destroying, like, one MS Sasuke post, like, Itachi. He even transformed into full Yuki, too, while he was in the water current, and he couldn't do shit. There's no way that Jiraiya is anywhere near that level. I mean, we've Uh scaled him before, and Jiraiya, lore-wise, when he, he couldn't even subdue, like, Four Tails Naruto, whether you want to say he fought him, or if he was just trying to seal him. Whatever. Yeah, stop he, bringing that up. It's not he got like it's near a... death. He was almost dead, bro. That huge scar, he yeah. was about to die. <laughs> I, I get so many comments yeah. like, stop bringing that up. Yeah, but, like, it, it's a statement. He fought the Four Tails and nearly got uh, killed. Yeah. Like, he <laughs> like, wasn't trying to kill Naruto, but he he still nearly got killed. That speaks to his durability. Yep. Mm-hmm. And Shows how much he can take. Especially if Orochimaru doesn't think anything of Jiraiya, and he's shitting himself around Itachi. It's very right. clear that Itachi's just more powerful in base. Yeah. Now, mm-hmm. uh, in terms of Sage mode, this is a different argument. Let's let's uh, let's talk about reanimated Itachi though, for real quick. I mean, hmm. yeah. Did anyone see this guy having a conversation with KCM Naruto, who's stronger yeah, than just Sage like Naruto? Yeah, talking like they're on fucking Discord, just like, wait, what happened to Sasuke? <laughs> <laughs> and he's gonna fuck up the village while they're just like throwing hands, <laughs> not even <laughs> <laughs> casually, and. It doesn't it's make like they're playing fucking Storm or something, dude. <laughs> and we've scaled this before. Tendo Pain is like six tails level, right? Mm-hmm. And we know that Naruto in his KCM was confident he would slap Nagato. So yeah. it's very clear that Naruto KCM stronger than six tails level. And we know that Jiraiya is only like five-ish tails level because he would get slapped by Tendo as well. As, yeah. you know, the Six Tails was stronger than Sage Naruto, and Sage Naruto has fully mastered God, Sage mode, me. not incomplete, and would probably be on Jiraiya's level, or stronger, or at least relative. Naruto's definitely way stronger than I know, Jiraiya I'm trying to be nice season. to the Jiraiya. Yeah, yeah. but if right. you want to give him <laughs> Don't the benefit that feeling's of the doubt, out. <laughs> he's like marginally stronger than Sage Naruto. And then, base Itachi swapping hands. So, you know, it, weekend. what weekend, by, not even by Edo Sensei, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. It's like, imagine if he had his Susano out. Oh, and speaking of sages, oh, y'all know that when uh, Itachi fought Kabuto, he could have killed him the second he stabbed him the first time. You right, know when exactly. he stabbed his tail and it like splits down two or something like that? Like, yeah. If that was what Itachi, he him with the Toads could play. Like, he if he can do gotcha. it to Nagato, yeah. he can do it to fucking Kabuto. Like, I love... No, actually, I hate Kabuto. I was gonna say, I know Kabuto's strong, but... He's not Nagato level, uh, right? Like, yeah. th- and there's no fucking way you can claim that. So, yeah, Itachi definitely could have sealed him. Now, to be fair, to give, you know, Kabuto the benefit of the doubt here and keep people from getting too mad at me, Kabuto was holding back in order to 
prevent himself from killing Sasuke in that battle. Yes. Oh. But Itachi still could have one-shot him if yeah. they were fighting one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, I mean, he wasn't holding it back, back against Itachi, though, which is very... Right, yeah, Itachi was holding back against Kabuto because he couldn't kill him, or else he wouldn't be able to undo the reanimation, yeah, used, which would yeah. defeat the whole purpose of fighting. So everyone's holding back. <laughs> explain, you know, the, the power of Sage Kabuto, you remember that Kabuto, even in part one, was Kakashi-ish level? Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, part two, he'd be even stronger since he's just studying jutsu with Orochimaru. Maru, yeah, I'm learning stuff. And he absorbs Orochimaru. He absorbs in, like, a lot of Orochimaru. Not like yeah. Sasuke, he absorbs a lot of him. So exactly, he has Hashirama yeah. cells, and then he gets perfect stage mode, a perfect snake stage mode. Snake stage or he can apply cool, imperfect man. because he had like some mutations, but that could just be snake stage mode for all we yeah. know. Um, and so it's very clear that this Kabuto is easily easily at least sage naruto level. he's probably the strong he's definitely probably the strongest sage in the series i mean yeah like well, he's not including the Kajurama, of course, uh, yeah. started happening like i actually want to talk about how strong this kabuto is because he's no joke and a lot of people sleep on him and the yeah. fact that itachi and sasuke both went like head to head with this I guy to both it's, fight like, him, it's, yeah. it's nothing to scoff at and i mean especially especially in this confrontation itachi yeah he also shows a feat where he's equal or possibly superior to EMS Sasuke, with let alone if Mangekyo Sharingan <laughs> with base Mangekyo, let alone with his Yada Mirror or his Totsuka Blade, which have infinite defense and oh, attack potency. Yeah. What is yeah. Jiraiya doing? How does Jiraiya win? That's what I really massive want to know. Rasengan tears through the Yada Mirror, even though it couldn't <laughs> fucking break Madara's base rib cage, Susano. Like Madara's. <laughs> Madara's base ribcage tanked a, a massive Rasengan. Right, with help from the Suchikage. The Suchikage propelled Madara into the Rasengan by lifting the ground up. Yeah. Right? <laughs> now, he kind of stopped a little bit, so it wasn't like he was accelerating into the Rasengan, but there was still, like, it, it definitely helped Naruto out. <laughs> and here's another thing with the Yadamir and the Tosuka Blade as well. So Orochimaru and Jiraiya are around relative. I'd argue Orochimaru's a little bit stronger. Mm. And yeah. then they both kind of have this pseudo-ish sage mode. Now, a lot of people don't know this, but the eight-tailed hydra form of Orochimaru is actually like a pseudo-sage mode oh, because it's yeah. directly compared to sage creatures, and it's stated that it's stronger than any sage snake out there. Oh, okay. Now, these sage snakes, Orochimaru cucks to his to Manda. He's like, yeah. Manda, please don't. I'll give you some bodies, bro. Just help me out, right? <laughs> so, and he's willing to go to that length against, you know, Gamma Buta. Gamma Buta was able to help against Pain a little bit, although Pain is obviously way stronger than Gamma Buta. Mm. But still, you get the point that Orochimaru with this Hydra form is way, way stronger than just Asani in base. And yeah. yet, Itachi tanks him like nothing and decapitates all just of his heads. Just cuts them all off, yeah. <laughs> like, like, <laughs> like, <laughs> swing of his sword, yeah. Yeah, so why... Why would Massive Rasengan just one shot pseudo Sage Orochimaru even? That doesn't even make well, sense. Well, he can hmm. he can dark smop the ground and then Itachi just can't do anything. <laughs> okay. I mean, he's stuck there in his Susano and he <laughs> fuck. <laughs> can do like it, like here, I've seen this argument presented before and it's like, alright, yeah, that's that's actually a fair point, because you can get underneath his feet, but then still how how does how does dry get through like what what is <laughs> yeah, what yeah is how's he actually attacking the yeah. and it's not like he, itachi loses the totska blade so it like Ita the dry won't be able to capitalize on that he'll yeah. just keep trying to launch range jutsu and like he'll get fucking stabbed with the totska blade and here's another thing people don't know about the mangekyo sharingan as well is that in at least in the novels it's stated that the Mangekyo Sharingan does not require eye contact. So even if you did argue Jiraiya knew about right. ocular jutsu, which, judging by their first encounter, he really yeah, didn't, because he was looking he to see right like, in the I eyes. Um, yeah, he looked Itachi right in the eyes, and even fucking Guy knew better than to do that. Mm, <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. And, and we also know that is a bit of a under the same spell and bad move, I suppose. So mm -hmm. the Mangekyo Sharingan, regardless if Didn't Jiraiya know looks at or not, yeah, is okay, pretty enough. much one-shot GG. Like, I'm going to be honest. I mean, it will mentally cripple him. Even even Kakashi, who after having all his friends die and all that, was still mentally composed and all that. He was bodied. Yeah. He went in the hospital after getting Yeah, he, he yeah. could not get out of the hospital without the help of fucking Tsunade, the greatest medical ninja of all time. <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> he yeah. used a lot of his chakra, but even after using Sukuyomi and... If, even if Jiraiya does somehow maintain fighting position, although mentally damaged, Itachi could still use Amaterasu and the Susano on top of Tsukuyomi, even despite right. the massive chakra drain. They used when all three Jutsu in his when, fight against Sasuke. When he had, when like, he cancer. Dead, yeah. 
<laughs> you're like cancer and you are spamming these things. So there's just no physical way I can imagine Jirai winning. This is coming from a Sanjutsu tard, all right? Like, <laughs> I should yeah. Be he so, reps like all Sage users and he's just like, yeah, they're all fucking like gods. Like, like every time we talk about a versus battle with Minato, we're just like, yeah, all right, maybe his opponent has a chance base to base, but what about when he uses Sage mode? Let's not even talk about KCM. Yeah, you exactly. know, like, I, I understand how strong Sage mode is, uh-huh. but we're not talking about Minato versus Itachi. Talking we're talking about, Jiraiya. about Jiraiya versus Itachi. The guy who takes five minutes to activate Sage mode, the guy who has a shittier version of Sage, Sage mode. mode. Yeah, can't do it like, himself. One shot, uh, he didn't get one shot, but he got an arm torn off by the Osura path. And a lot of people say that that was a surprise attack. Fucking whatever. That just speaks to the fact that Jiraiya has shit sensory Yeah, he did come sense that he's that, a yeah. sage and he couldn't see it coming. Like, yeah. what the fuck? Even though Naruto could sense the third Raikage, he even stated that Senjutsu's purpose can sense danger from a wide range. Yeah, right, he, he like sensed halfway across the planet while in like the middle of the war to figure out what's going on. Like He just immediately knew people were dying. And here's Jiraiya not able to sense this fucking like, dude like right behind Hind him. him yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So Damn. you can kind of see where we're coming from. Yeah. Itachi obliterates Jiraiya. The part one, we were talking about this before stream, but part one, it's never been retconned before, right? I mean, it's... Yeah, it's no, like, what, what are you talking about? <laughs> it's never Remember been retconned. Remember when Minato was the strongest Tokage and Hiruzen was the second strongest since he was supposed to be stated to be stronger than Tobirama and Hashirama? <laughs> and he knew every jutsu? <laughs> yeah, he knew every jutsu. Every single one. In God and Flying Thunder God. And... <laughs> <laughs> and Edo Tensei, all of the jutsu ever created by Leaf Ninja, Hiruzen could use. <laughs> so, yeah, you kind of see where we're going. So, I think that pretty much sums it up, unless you have something else to add. I think. I mean, like, I'm trying to think of, like, meme arguments or, like, be yeah. like, fair to Jiraiya at the very least, but I really what about, don't understand what he has. What about that sound argument? Oh, yeah, his genjutsu is Breaking faster his than sound, sound yeah. so Itachi can't dodge it, even though he blocked fucking Kieran. Which is just fast, it's faster than lightning. <laughs> yeah. yeah, not like Danny and Sasuke was dodging sound in the forest of death or fucking whatever. Like, this, that's such oh, a right, shitty yeah. thing to use. Like, if anything, that just means Jiraiya's Genjutsu is a shitty one. Oh, because it takes time for the sound to reach for, for the sound to reach the enemy, and everybody in Naruto that's like S class plus is way faster than sound. They're like lightning timers. For, and Seth said earlier, like he's like, well, to be fair, I think the Damn. point is that like by the time you like hear the sounds, you're already affected by it. And I'm like, no, I'm pretty sure as soon as Itachi sees the fucking frog start yelling, like, Wah! and like singing the Genjutsu, he's gonna be like, oh yeah, let me get the fuck out of the way. He figured yeah. out Chibaku Tensei in fucking point two seconds. Like he's he's gonna understand that these two frogs on Jiraiya's shoulders yelling means Genjutsu. And especially because this Sharingan can perceive all chakras, Genjutsus, and stuff like that. So he probably right. would see chakra flowing his direction, especially since he's faster than the sound itself. And yes, he's faster than sound because even Tamari in part one, fighting Curse Mark 2 to Yuya, right. was able to swing her fan when sound was point blank in her face. Yeah, like okay, damn, right yeah. Right in front of her face in black lines. I love it when yeah, they bring all these little scenarios up. It just makes like so much sense to it. To Yuya. So even to Yuya is faster than sound, let alone Itachi. Like, you got right. that's some weak shit, man. You can really, I can't believe someone actually used that argument. Tayuya <laughs> blitzes Itachi. Uh, Zaku blitzes Itachi. All of Orochimaru's henchmen from part one blitz Itachi, to be honest. And it's like, if it's a real, legit death battle, don't you think Itachi's gonna hit Jiraiya with Genjutsu first? And yeah. Like, it's way easier to use and way more Well, convenient. like, here's the thing. If it's a death battle and Jiraiya starts in Sage Mode, why can't Itachi start with the Susano out? If he doesn't uh-huh. start in Sage Mode, he's gonna fucking wreck Jiraiya before he gets yeah. the Susano out. Even fucking Orochi I mean, before he gets Sage Mode out. Like... <laughs> Where, where is this fucking he solos Kisame and Itachi bullshit coming from? How yeah. do people actually like think like that. like yeah. Seth said earlier? It's like part one, yeah, no, never been retconned before, not once, <laughs> not ever. It's never happened, not a single time. Like remember that time Sasuke said it was rare for an Uchiha to even have the base Sharingan? Yeah, I do. 
<laughs> we know. I like. I'll well, have Izanami and Izanagi now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's there's just no way Jiraiya wins feasibly. So anyway, that's that's gonna well, be the go. video. Hope you enjoyed. Bye. <laughs> Damn, poor Jiraiya, man. Don't stand chance. <laughs> I like it when they both do those videos. Go. I don't understand how I missed that one, but never mind. Um, yeah. It's been a while since I've done a versus in the Naruto video stuff. Uh, do enjoy those, though. So that was cool. Poor Jiraiya, man. Don't stand chance. That was cool. I like that. So yeah, thank you guys very much for uh, for watching. What do you guys think of that? What do you guys think of this? Click like, subscribe if you haven't already. Leave comments down below. Let me know what you want to discuss in future videos. And I'll see you guys. See you guys next time.